Hello, hello! Playing Oregon Trail today. It's uh, available on Steam for five dollars, and it's a very fun game. It's uh, pretty difficult. We are going to play on suicide. Uh, I've played once before. Um, I'll play the intro. Click on an enemy and draw a line to yourself in order to shoot. Missing a little bit here. Wow, there it goes, there it goes. Okay. Wow, this is getting pretty intense. Ah, uh, here he is. Main man Clements. Looks like I just saved your bacon. Uh, this is stand a better chance out there if we stick together. All right. He used to be a priest. My name? They call me. Where's that? They call me Mike. Even with the two, this won't be long to survive. Do you know anybody we can count on in a pinch? Well, I mean, there's this guy named, uh, Gare. On the, like, I know this Chris kid. And then, I think there's Derek. Um, and then, um, and then Harold. Can, can be good in a pinch. Yeah, yeah, those are right. Okay. Oh, they're still alive? Oh, thanks, that's awesome, you just learned their names. <laughs> you need a way to get around. Old station wagon. Let's get moving. Sure. So, playing through. This is pretty much a tutorial. Haven't played in a while, so I decided to go with it. Um, Clemens is going to take me to my friends. So he has enough food to make it to DC. Um, if you're not already aware, this game's a spoof, sort of parody, recreation of... Or Oregon Trail. Pretty faithful to the source material. It's uh, really fun. Clements is just getting owned. Breaking bones, getting dysentery, bitten by a zombie, and we're out of fuel. Alright. Well, this looks nice. I like what they did with it. Okay, so just as the station wagon runs out of fuel, you coast into the city. Your radio blaring in a nearby window. All survivors in Washington, D.C. government has declared a class 3 biohazard in the area. Commencing a nuclear strike. Nice. Okay, get out while you can. Alright. Well, at least the military is doing something. They're not their nuke, yes. We have a time problem. I'll look for your friends. You should be scavenging for supplies. We've got a place on the west coast that is supposed to be safe. Oh, it's only on the other side of the country. Take my journal. So if I want to look at stuff, I'll read his journal. So we have four hours. What do I want to scavenge for? Fuel is essential. Ammo is essential. Tire. Battery. Okay. Yeah, I feel comfortable with that. Okay. One of those things bit me. I can't stand the thought of becoming... You're gonna have to put me down. Oh, no. Put down Clements. Sorry, buddy. I'll read your journal. I'm not gonna read his journal. It's a lie. Okay, so we're on the road. And Harold's exhausted. We made it pretty far. Rumbling sound comes from behind you. What is this nonsense? Don't the enemies hit the station wagon? Whoa! It's a herd of deer!
pretty sinister gear, judging from the music. This is, this is madness. Are they zombie gear, or are they just deer? Oh, we might not, we're probably not going to be able to find out. I'm going to say there's zombie gear, just because... Oh, crap, I thought I just lost. Ah, damn, that did a lot of damage to the station wagon. Because I freaking crashed into him there. Noob mistake. Just really rookie gameplay. Well, we're gonna roll into the city. Oh, caught in a blizzard. Alright, we're, we're gonna roll into town. I don't care if there's a blizzard. Okay, Pittsburgh! Okay. A large number of zombies just have to come and eradicate the bandits. I'll take care I'll take care of the bandits. No pain, no gain, right? Best so far. Oh my God. Good. Got it. Twenty-seven dollars. Zombies just outside my home. We'll give it a shot. If I was really good, I don't need to pull it all the way back onto my dude. Just be able to free, free throw it. tutorial fight. And Clements isn't here to save me. Just hope I'm not burning through more ammo than it's worth. Alright. Four med kits. Very valuable gain. Alright. Nice, nice. Let's see what we have here to buy. Eleven for ammo. Eleven for twenty. Okay, I'll buy it. M is always great. Um, five for ten. It's because I don't have any money left. Well, I may as well. I think they want auto shop. Any upgrades? Armored windows. Oh well. Supplies. You want to trade one of their muff muffler for one of your tire? Yes, I will take that trade because I want a muffler. What time is it right now? 9 p.m. 
We're gonna stay in town for the night. So we'll wait in town to trade. Wow, everybody's low on health. Alright, let's let's sleep. 44 grammo for 95 of their food. That's a bad trade. Alright. Um, we're gonna go. We're gonna rest. For a good amount of time. Let's see if we get some HP back. The reason we're doing so bad is because we have no freaking food. Here, stop. Why? No. We're gonna keep resting. Yep. As bad as it is to starve, we're gonna rest until the morning, and then we're gonna scavenge for some food. I didn't realize that we ran out of food already. Which is just great. Alright, let's see. 5 a.m. It's still high. Alright, we could rest for a bit longer. Until zombie activity decreases. Obviously, it goes up at night. Okay. Car's looking in pain. I'll take care of it in a second. Scavenge. So I walk around and I pick up what I find. Taken out, zombies. Taken out. Just got a steam achievement. Killing X amount of zombies. up here or what? Thirty ounces of food. It's pretty solid. Let's keep scavenging. Found some scrap from the looks of it. scrap. It's a lot of scrap, just to find. Zombie activity is low. I'm tempted to keep scavenging. How much food do we have? We'll keep going until we get some more. Then I'll check and see what rations are set to. So if they're set to something too big, then Food, 15 scrap. Pretty even split. So I found 15. I had a net gain of 5, which means to take it up 10. Okay. 2 ounces of food per hour. I'm gonna have to lower it for now. Repair the station wagon. Use more scrap for more chance to succeed. Let's hope I, let's hope I succeed. I really got my fingers crossed here. Heartbreak if I don't. Oh my god. Bump it up to 77% chance. Come on. Nice, nice, nice. Good. Good. We're gonna... We're gonna leave town. Cross a horde of zombies in order to continue. Appears 
it appears agitated. If it's agitated, I don't want to sneak through. We're, we're gonna do, we're gonna go through it. We're gonna break out. Look at look at this. this swag. Lost one fuel. I'll take it. Two hundred miles to the mall. Let's go to the mall. <sighs> A gas can fell off the car. Perfect. Now we're out of fuel. That's just dandy. We just lost two cans of fuel on absolutely nothing. We're gonna have to stop. One of their tire for two of your med kits. Now give me fuel. Well, here's what we'll do. We'll scavenge. That's a big bag of food. So I'm gonna be essentially stranded until I can find somebody that wants to trade fuel. I'll just have to take whatever deal they get me. ounces of food that's solid okay so I don't have any tires but I have a muffler and two batteries tire must have fallen off at some point that's okay could be worse um anybody to trade with may wait another hour and see what happens one of their battery for two of your fuel. Yeah, I definitely want to do that. Oh my god. I'm going to have to take that deal. And we're just going to stick around for the night here and scavenge and then rest up. It's our best course of action. Nice slow advance to the, uh, on the Oregon Trail. I just picked up something that spawned. Okay. Okay, look at that. 100 ounces and 15 scrap. Nice, nice. Um... As good as scavenging is, I'm going to have to hold off because I don't want to use all my ammo. I want to try and maintain. We can up the dosage of food. Let's repair this before we go. I don't know. No, we're just going to... We're going to go on the road. High zombie activity. Deer jumps out in front of the car. Nice. Nice. Chris sits too hard on one fuel. Why are you sitting on the fuel? Ugh. Okay. What jobs are here? A crate fell off the back. I don't I don't need a muffler that bad. Buy Ammo. Yeah, that's a great deal. <laughs> Excuse me. Meet the mic for the next one. <gasps> okay. We're good, we're good. Do they want to buy anything from me? Any sort of price that's decent? I'll sell a med kit, and I'll sell a couple scrap. I'll buy this ammo. Wow, really? Just a not an impressive town at all. It's really underwhelmed. Please, just work. Please. I, 
over 80% chance of getting that. Like, really. Okay. Let's see how we do. Please. Great, great. Probably one of the most intense moments in gaming. You're waiting to see if that bar goes. I don't know why I just did it with one. Obviously a failure. Here we go, we'll do it one more time and then we'll rest up. So these guys are draining. Okay, good. good. Done. Rest for a bit. I don't really want to be on the road right now either. In the middle of the night, there's a lot of zombies. Way more chance to get like bitten. Just bad things to happen. Top everybody off. Perfect. Then we'll see. 5 a.m. It's high. There's a combat trainer here. I don't have $80 to spend on a useless thing. Alright. Talk to stranger. Let's just get a little bit of lore. When the infection first hit, everyone was in a panic, looting and killing each other. Now they roam the roads, chasing vague rumors and hopeless dreams. The roads are blocked with those who failed before them. It's pretty deep. Yeah. And we're going to be out of fuel. How did I already forget that we're out of fuel? Alright. Well, now we're going to be at the mercy of... Whoever. Do we even make it out of town? Butter or cheese or ice cream, bless me, I don't think I can do anything without the comforts. Trade. One of your tire for five of their dollars. No, one of, four of your scrap for one of their fifty. Yes. I'll keep waiting. Let's see if there's any other people looking to trade. One of their tire for one of your battery. Another tire for two of your medkits. No. I'll do one more hour here and then we'll head out. Really want to see. Nobody to trade with. Go out. One can of fuel. Beautiful, beautiful. This guy clears up. What time we spend waiting? A rumbling from behind you. Don't let the enemies hit the station. Alright. We're gonna assume these are the zombie deer again. Boss fight. Yeah, I'm really fighting here. Okay. Okay, I'm getting better at this. Dodging. Whoop. Good. Good. <coughs> Red the needle. We did it. Didn't even lose any health. Of course, everybody just kind of dies slowly anyway in this game. Indianapolis! Yay! Bandits, but for a muffler? Dude, I'm in. I can do bandits. Okay. There we go. Oh, that should have hit him. Just go down, just go down, just die. You were shot. Oh my god. Rookie. Rookie mistake. We'll go for this mission instead. See if I can get some scrap out of it. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Wish you had my swag levels. 
So it gets stuck. Got it. That running gun. Anything good at the auto shop? Upgrade? Super last tires. Ah, too bad I only have four dollars. Alright, we're gonna sell some scrap for some money to pick up some ammo. Not interested at all. Done. 11 a.m. Waking up in the morning. We'll scavenge for the day and then stay the night. Trading, because I need fuel still. So, we're we'll gonna take that route. Pretty much stay a day in Indianapolis. Something terrible befalls me. Ooh. This is money. Fifteen ounces of food. That is a great, great turnout because I'm going to be able to buy. Oh my god! It hurts me to not buy the bullets. It really does. Oh man. <gasps> I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Twenty-three in stock. Holy crap, they have 23 fuel and the price is that high. I'll tell you what, I'll sell some more of my scrap since I have so much. And I will buy two fuel. Guess what? We're gonna go back to scavenging. You can get at me. Hey, more scrap. Scrap, honestly is one of the best resources because it's really common, you find it a lot, and it's always like two dollars for a piece. Always a great deal on scrap. Well, the, the only problem with scavenging is any combat you end up using bullets, and a lot of times not so easy to come by bullets. That'd be a lot of scrap if they're just spawning one. Yeah, 15. Great, great, great deal. Six food left. Nice. So, let's probably should have adjusted rationing sooner. Let's see, uh, fingers crossed we find some here. Some money. I suppose that could come in handy. stock up on fuel at this place. Ah, some food. Since we're not on the road, I can keep rations pretty low. And we'll still do alright. In terms of our health. Because by not having as much rations, you're more at risk to all the randomly generated diseases that can just affect your people. Okay, okay. Let's see. We'll just keep on scavenging. Keep on keeping on. Nice miss. Nice miss. Ah, oh my god. At least I got the scrap, right, guys? Did I do good? Horrible. Getting attacked.
combat training, not combat training. Fifteen for one tire. Oh, there's tires I don't have. Wow. Let's just keep waiting for some trades. Keep waiting, keep waiting. So I slowly run out of food. I try scavenging for more. Do a quick number crunch. Cost fifty dollars to get that much ammo. I could buy a tire for cheaper if I really wanted. To. All right. Well, we're gonna have to go look for food. Hey. Okay. Down, go down. Good, I got, I got the scrap. Oh, that was clutch. Wow. Intensity, intensity levels. 100 food and 20 scrap. Great haul. Great haul. Look at that, another 100 food. Big plays. I might end up splitting this and do uh, a few episodes because it's been going for a while. I'm actually doing very well. Scavenging at night, as we see, is a lot higher risk. So many more zombies. Burn through a lot of ammo. Together. Okay, okay. Nice, nice. Let's go back to the town. Sell some of our newly found scrap. Some 20 of it. Now we got some, some spending money. So let's buy another fuel. Let's buy some ammo. Wonderful. See, does anybody want to trade? Wait for an hour and then we'll rest up. Four of your scrap for one of their tire, absolutely. Seven of my scrap for one of my tire, absolutely. Oh, no, you're not getting my muffler. So part of your car breaks down, you have to replace it, so that's why you want to have those extra car parts on hand. Messed up. I can't remember if I regenerate health from resting. Nope, I gotta use a med kit to heal myself. That's cool. That's cool. Okay. Rest up for a bit longer. No stop. Go over here and trade. We'll wait till about six or seven, and then we'll rest it one more time. I do not need a battery that badly at all. Okay. Three dollars for two of their fuel. That is a that's slightly better than the market by two dollars so I'm not gonna I can't even accept it so glad I turned it away 85 of their food two of your med kits no thank you okay spare one of their tire for one of your med kit don't need tire that bad Nope. Keep on, keep on. 
one of my tire for 31 of their ammo. Do a quick number crunch. No, thank you. Done. Still high. Rest for a moment. Okay. Yeah, we're good to go. Next stop, the farmland. <laughs> Sorry, I just opened up the menu. Trucking along, some wild fruit. Sparks shoot out the back, your muffler's dragging on the road, time to replace it. But I replace it from supplies. That's right, all those people wanted my muffler. No, Harold! Harold has a fever. Caught in a blizzard, but we made it to the farmland. Alright, I'm gonna end this video here. Hope you got sort of a flavor for what the game's like. It's uh, available on Steam for five bucks. Uh, I'm definitely gonna be doing a continuation on this, because I don't feel like uh, you guys need some closure to see what happens. But this will be the introductory video. Uh, thanks for watching. Check out the channel for more of, it, more of me, and uh, subscribe if you enjoy it.